as with most seamen, when you've been at sea for weeks and months at a time, you tend to find that the first thing they do is get off ship, straight up to spend the money and have a few jars. The likes of myself, who, who say seamen, ex seamen, dockers, and what have you, we've known that many people around the city that many years that we still had. It's like uh, moths to a flame. We all come back into the city. Well, Mad, I mean, Mad Monday is basically just um, older people, as I say, like myself, who um, get around the city, basically on pub crawls. We oh, Mad Monday. Well, that was the day of the hawkers, the, the barrack women and the men took the, the, the fruit boxes back. I mean, you start off in the city centre near the wine lodge. He's got a little bit of a buzz on. And that's when they, they'd all celebrate on a Monday. They'd always have a drink on a Monday. Some of them went down Fenwick Street, the slaughterhouse, and different places, out the way places, as we'd call them, you know. I used to dread Mondays with <laughs> my mother. She'd always bring all the bad women back to our house on a Monday night. There'd be bottles of whiskey. And end up back going back to where you'd probably come from, to maybe to the Little Globe or, or the Little Coopers or somewhere like that. You may do about six or seven pubs and. And they tell their life stories. And I used to sit by the table. They would say, go to bed. And I'd say, I don't want to listen to them talking about when they were young and things that happened to them in life. To me, that was the, one of the nicest parts of my life. Sing songs in most of them, karaoke's. And if you're not a seaman or a docker, you know, they all think they can sing anyway, like, so it, it, it is just a bit of a laugh, really. <laughs>